All right, so in this video, I'm gonna to talk to you about five things that I like about the Harley-Davidson Detachable Sissy Bar. Let's check it out. What's going on YouTube? BK Low is back in the building. And we're out here in some of my favorite North Shore roads out on Long Island. As you can see, I'm out here with my girl Jenny in the building. Um, I know you all like when she makes appearances in these videos, but I thought it'd be appropriate to have her in this video since um, the particular part that I'm talking about, I mostly got well, I would say, yeah, mostly got with her in mind. Which is, of course, the Harley-Davidson Detachable Sissy Bar. But I do have to interrupt this video to stop at this pond. Because your girl Jenny has always wanted to stop here. And she saw pictures of me and my boy FXFB NYC here. And was upset that I had gone here without her. So we'll stop here for a little bit so she could take in the peacefulness of the pond and I could show you what she looks like on this sissy bar. I know you wanted to see the pond. It's beautiful. <laughs> Is it everything you dreamed of? Okay so as you can see that's how she sits on the sissy bar. Um, she does have a giant backpack that has all of our stuff from the weekend so um, you know that changes things a little bit but She's still sitting on there pretty comfortably. But yeah, I'm doing I'm doing five things that we like about the sissy bar. Is that okay with you? Huh? Is that okay with you? Yeah. Okay. Did, did you have enough pond time? All right, let us continue. You good? Yeah. All right. Sorry, we had to take that little detour. Like I said, she's uh, she's been wanting to stop at that pond for a while. So I figured we were over here. Might as well oblige her. But here we go. So five things I like about this new Harley-Davidson detachable sissy bar and thing number one so thing number one is the passenger just being locked into position with this sissy bar so where the sissy bar sits and how it's angled and where the passenger sits makes it so your passenger doesn't go anywhere when you brake or when you accelerate Whereas with the older sissy bar I was running, when the bike would pull, she would pull back with it and then pull me with it. So that would, um, you know, I didn't realize how annoying that was until I put this sissy bar on and just having her be locked into position allows me to ride a little bit more like I would ride without her being on the bike and makes me a hell of a lot more comfortable. So. The stability that it gives the passenger is amazing and at the end of the day is going to make your ride a lot more comfortable. So that's thing number one, which is stability. Alright, so thing number two that I really like about this sissy bar, and that is the fact that they offer the um, additional backrest that's really easy to put on and take off. and she really really appreciates that and again that helps out with item number one which is keeping her stable on the bike so that's a big one that they offer that backrest and um you wouldn't believe how much of a difference it makes it really does make a difference she's just like i said she's a lot more comfortable with that which at the end of the day is going to make my ride that much more comfortable all right so thing number three and this is more if you're um, going to be touring with your Harley Davidson, but which, which you know I do. I put in a lot of miles. I do a lot of long road trips. But I really like the fact that I could use this on my road trips. It's tall enough where I could put my Buildwell bag on there perfectly. And the other thing that's amazing is 
if you see my Biltwell bag video, it has a uh, built-in backrest on that. But the problem with that bag is, if you're not a bigger guy like myself, then my back actually would not reach that backrest. So I remember on my last trip, I would have to wedge in a bunch of stuff in between the sissy bar and my bag in order to actually hit the backrest. The nice thing about this sissy bar is with the backrest that I have on there, that takes care of that for me. So having that backrest includes the couple inches that I need to push my bag out a little bit closer to me so I can actually be comfortable on those long rides. So I really like the fact that this sissy bar is gonna really shine for touring. All right, so thing number four that I really like about this sissy bar, and this is, again, if you're someone who's putting in those miles and touring, is it's 100% compatible with my Leather Pro detachable bags. So it was really easy. The docking hardware for that just went right over the docking hardware for the detachable sissy bar, and you could run them both with no problem. So installation was really easy on this one. Again, that probably deserves its own category, but I'm only doing five for this one. And um, yeah, just the fact that they thought about that and it's compatible with running bags as well makes this just a perfect, a real perfect sissy bar for touring and putting in those miles. All right, so thing number five that I like about this sissy bar, and I'm sure a lot of people are gonna laugh about this just because it's in the name, but I just love the fact that it's detachable and it's easily detachable i'm talking about in a number of seconds you're going to get that locking mechanism off and you know if you're like me you know i like to run my bike without a sissy bar these days i just really like the look of it and i also just like not having that extra weight on the back of the bike if i don't need it you know i like to do burnouts from time to time and taking that weight off helps that happen so again, it is in the name, but you know, that's one of the, probably the biggest thing that you're gonna get out of the sissy bar is A, a functional sissy bar for your passenger and for your luggage, and also easily detachable when you're riding solo, if you don't like the look of a sissy bar um, when you're riding solo. So that's it. So I'll put the links below for our, the uh, dark, for the docking hardware and the actual sissy bar that I'm running, as, as well as the pad. Um, I highly recommend it if you're someone that uh, is not trying to run a sissy bar at all times. My, again, my passenger is very happy. She's really comfortable. And at the end of the day, that makes me a lot more comfortable. So that is the lowdown on the Harley Davidson detachable sissy bar. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them below. And yeah, we're going to enjoy the rest of our a little gloomy back road ride here on this beautiful spring day as always thank you for watching and BK Lo is out <laughs>